Hello there and welcome back to Strategic Command World War II War in Europe as we continue our fight to the last bullet against Axis AI on expert difficulty level with all the bonuses granted to the AI which is pretty brutal and France will soon see that as Poland does right now hopefully it's after all half of the October so maybe some rain will help us out here but Poland will die this then there is no way so Without further ado, let's jump into the next turn, shall we? We'll do probably two turns as per usual on the beginning. So now it's about taking the uh, Irish port roads, and of course, well, why I'm not going to do this? Because of this. Uh, no, no. And 1000 uh, national morale points is two Italian battleships, so uh, no. Oh! Yes, that's nice, that's nice. That's what I wanted to see. Finland moving with French coast to it. Infantry weapons. Oh, that's huge. That's very huge. This game is starting to roll very, very well. 262, but we our economy is not yet fully recovered. Okay, that's very nice. Very nice that Finland already moved a little bit. For the French, of course. At the French expense, shall I say. The wolf has fallen and the weather is beautiful. Which is very bad news. Because it means that Warsaw's doom is guaranteed now. And you will disappear just like that. But you will at least take two hits. Okay, three hits from Bombardment. That's nice, and you still manage to hurt them by one point. Hurt him. Oh yes, you are so good. Goodbye, but you will be forever remembered. Yeah, do not attack Warsaw, just encircle it. Encircle it. No, two points, at least you've made them pay with one. Hurt him. Hurt him. Yes, beautiful. Ooh, you will die, but you have won my heart. The points hurt him. Yes, at least. You've done some damage. And backstab from the east. Finally secured the German victory. And with that, the Polish army is completely gone. It was eviscerated to the leg. And the last three cities in the east are falling. Polish morale collapses from the loss of Warsaw, so you survived. Well, uh, you died on the fourth German turn, so that's not the best result, but it's definitely better than three turns. So, German plunders uh, a lot for some reason. German forces the Red Army to fall back to the Soviet frontier as they occupy all of Poland. That I have never seen happen before. Oh my good lord. That's very bad news. And very good at the same time. Because we don't need to worry about that, I guess. I'm not sure if... Yeah. Vilma is being transferred back. Do we need to worry about this? The annexation of... of uh, these countries? The, Bal uh, the Baltic countries? I'm not sure it happens now. I did not have that in the script, that's for sure. Which means that Minsk is now a liability to defend. It's pretty bad. Narev code destroyed, Modern code destroyed, also Garrison destroyed, but look at this, that's pretty huge. 
That's a huge deal. That's amazing. And I think about it. Yeah, that's pretty good and good. Oh. Gold. And from Vinitsa Proskurov. Northwestern front. And which is that? So I guess we still get the camp. Yeah, we should we should get them, it seems. Proskurov. Yeah. Proskurov, mm -hmm, because we do not get the wolf. Vinitsa. Let's take a look at the map. Instantly, close cure of. Ooh. Ooh. You're gone, boys. You're gone. And where will those units appear? I'm not exactly sure. Not at all. But anyway, let's start with something different. Which is. Well, this is very bad. I think I need to abandon those plans of making defensive life on Dnieper now. Maybe not this, but definitely I will need to put the other uh, engineer in Smolensk, that's for sure now. Speaking of other engineer, I need to buy it now. Okay, so that's it for the Soviet Union when it comes to the United States. Industrial technology comes first. Spying and intelligence next. You're doing fine where you are, you are not doing fine where you are, so let's move you south. Petrovsk is secured. Somewhat. And now this is really fine. This is already fine. I'm going to move back for now. So I'm not very sure what's going on right here. So that was an interesting turn of events. Let's move with the remaining guys. We will be at six, uh, six, eight, seven supply now, which is nice. But I need to move in here to six. Next turn we will have six from this hex. I'm pretty sure of it. Yeah, that's nice. Speaking of Britain, let's invest into research. Control and that will be it for now for this turn. Unmoved warfare might be also viable, but I will need to invest into the lot. And I need a lot of points still, as I need to actually reinforce some of these guys. So this actually core might remain here, I will think about it. Reinforce it a bit and you buy one point because you cost way too much of the price. So I want to send Lord Gord out before I actually switch with, switch him with other mm, better, of course, uh, HQ like Monty or somebody else. Okay, you are out of port, fully paid off, which is very, very nice. You are ready to pounce. Let's send you out. At right 9, you are at 7. Let's move you back to port. Air destroyer, so you may raid as well. 5, so you will not back. Nice. A bit of experience, still not shown, but it is. As you can see here. It is important. For sure. We don't need to reinforce you yet. We will send you out though. But one unit upgraded. I think it's time to reinforce my carrier and start upgrading the other one. 
that's nice. I cannot, so I will move you to France instead. Sitting here. And speaking of France, let's go with Finland. And let's go with reinforcements. Are fine where you are, but I need to take care of him first. Order six. First six. First units that will actually fly. So you, you, and let's move here. And let's go with you. seventeen, so we can buy two points for you. All right. So who do I leave here? Definitely one of these garrisons needs to go. Transport, yeah. We will need to be transported. I will actually do it immediately because I not. Actually I know why not. We have just moved in, we have just moved in, let's go with you maybe. Mm -hmm. Now I have not forgotten about you. Let's go here and into Tunis itself next turn. Now you will move to Beirut, but you will move to Damascus. It's way too big of an unit to waste it in here. Those guys are not that combat worthy anytime soon so it's not that huge of a loss they die that's that's new that's that's very new I'm not even sure that will significantly boost my income which means the rest of research will be looking very well but will that be enough and I'm even considering now going into spying and intelligence with that extra money not sure I can afford it, unfortunately. I would have to guess, like, definitely under shit here, which means 800, mm -hmm. 975, I will need to here, and definitely in those locations as well. Maybe, maybe I will have enough, so it would be. Hmm? Not. Well, it's a bit too much, so maybe not. One should here. Maybe I can squeeze it somehow. Or into production instead. Might be a viable option as well. So when is my en engineer going to appear? In like April. Okay, that's acceptable. We will have plenty of work. Mind it. I might even send you out to Smolensk immediately instead of going after those locations. That that's that changes a lot. But I'm not sure if that's going to pop. And if that would be the case, then I will need actually someone in Polsk to prepare defensive line. they can literally drop into here. Well, that's not, not really a possibility because they don't have supply in here. But, let's take it. 8. HQ would have to be in like here. Like 6. Provide 10, I mean. 10, 9, 8, 7, somewhere around that here. No, not really a possibility. So maybe pause, it's not a good event. And that definitely makes this game interesting, at least. That's for sure. Okay. We are doing fine, I think. And that will be it for this turn, but we are like 15 minutes in, so it means another turn. Let's go for it. French morale suffers from the fall of Poland, well, it happens. 
Germany celebrates victory over Poland and the return of Danzig. I'm going to say yes to this decision event. They might be useful somewhat. If they buy me one more turn, Paris. And this is obviously the decision event regarding uh, the French. Um, whether we want to invest into France or Poland. And I'm going to say yes, because France is going to die. So I want extra unit for the British. Long range aircraft, that's very nice. Advanced fighters level 1 for the US. That's a nice income, that's a lot of lost. And no Finland hit, I will need to invest, I think now. Those remaining British cheats, I need to do it. If I want to actually generate some nice value from the French cheats. I think I've waited long enough. They retake the hex, mine hex, but unfortunately for them it will be at zero for quite some time. Nothing much happening yet. France. In Germany can declare war on France in between February and June. And it depends only on weather for the air power. So, in other words, if air power can launch attack, they will declare war on the very first time it is possible. So, that's something to keep in mind. I haven't seen any action around here yet, which is good, considering all things. We don't really want subs, uh, destroyers to be uh, upgraded yet, because they sucks against other ships, but I might actually upgrade you instead. Uh, how are you doing? Might be time to uh, relocate you, but we're go getting a ton of MPPs. So the you know, which is very, very nice, welcoming change. Infantry warfare is the first. Actually, no. Industrial technology. I will invest first into industrial technology, infantry warfare next. I feel like I, like I have to retreat. I don't know what to say about what happened last time. That's for sure. We do. We are taking care of the locations we need to. So let's leave them as they are. Okay, let's use you to swap those two later on. Mm -hmm. So USA and USSR are done with now a remainder of points with France. I think it's time to send you out boys. At least you because you are a bit too far away for my good taste. Move. Oh a bit too far. Let's go with that. You can stay somewhere around here. Now let's make sure that I invest all of the cheats, British cheats, into where I need to invest them. And we have 40% of our quite a few turns. Now I need to reinforce the reminder of them. 
I think I will fully reinforce you. It's not very efficient, but it's all right. And I guess I will still send out those two garrisons. So. I need to start getting those carriers ready to evacuate as well. I will send you out. To Italy. And I will send also this branch out. Let's upgrade you fully. You can travel how far? Not even to Gibraltar, so I will do send you in here and I will move you into Tunis to be upgraded there. Sounds fine-ish. I don't have any upgraded ships ready yet to move into your position, so I will not send them out. That's it. Let's reinforce you, maybe. Surely you can move into better position. Got 57 MPPs, so it's time definitely for reinforcements. You first, then you, you, you. They will not reach this line, and you, but we can. Perhaps you, because you are pretty damn weak. For what we have coming is quite soon. How many MPs per transport? Too much. Okay, so no transport for you now. I might cover like Nancy and this city, I think. That's a good call with garrisons. You might take care of Kara for now. And we need to send those guys next turn. All of them. So it costs a lot. And I will need definitely at least one garrison sent out immediately to make sure that French morale is not losing a bit too much. But we'll see about that. Okay, so that will be it for this turn, shall I say two turns, so thank you for watching as we continue our fight to the last bullet against Allied, uh, Allied Axis AI on expert difficulty level with all the bonuses granted to it. Well, that was an interesting turn of events, I'd say. Never seen that one. I actually not sure what will happen to the Baltic states. Which, if nothing happens, it's actually better. Because, well, we don't need to worry about North at all, and we have literally two front lines on the band, think about it. Which also means they can on they <laughs> the Germans have only two forces, two, two fronts to focus their tanks on, which is not really the greatest, but it is what it is. That will be it for this time, so once more thank you for watching and I will see you next time.